you do? Uh, white boy. Uh, <laughs> started back in grade six. Uh, I actually made a little song parody to a Megan Trainer song. It was called Your Swords Are Swinging and it was a Minecraft parody. Uh, I thought it was funny at the time and then looking down the road, it was, <laughs> I guess it's where I started, but uh, it's something will never get out. I agreed to be interviewed because I wanted a little bit more exposure, although I don't want my life to be consumed by, by this passion, I guess. Um, I have an album dropping soon, I have a music video coming out, and I just wanted more content for people to kind of see me and see who I am, see what I'm doing. For a minute I was acting like a clown, like a clown. Then my bros he told me, homie, they won't hear you when you down. For a minute I was acting like a fool, like a fool. They say one more test, we finna kick you out of school. I express myself through rap music because it's what it's in right now. You can't go through social media like Instagram, TikTok, Twitter without seeing someone rapping or someone doing something related to rap. So I felt like that I could take my own style on things and put it into some music and make my own type of raps. It's more like a comedic type approach at rapping. I really just hop on the mic, say what I'm thinking, uh, usually about girls, which I don't get, or drinking a lot, which I don't do, spending money, nice cars. None of that's actually like true stuff, but I think it's ironic that I throw it in there. It's kind of a comedic output, you know? I have friends with family members that like listening to my stuff, my own family. I love making songs for them, for them to listen to. My mom is a huge impact on like what I say in songs because I'll show her a new song and she'll be like, oh, I, di I didn't hear you talk about me in that song. And I'm like, oh, I gotta run back up to the studio in my room and go, like, oh, I love my mom, you know, say stuff like that. <laughs> you know what, see like, I don't want it to consume me in the fact that like everything I do is related to rap or related to the rap industry. My two biggest role models, Chance the Rapper and Lil Yachty, consider themselves more of artists than rappers, although it's in Chance's name, because they want to be more artists, known as artists, because they do more than just rap. They have a style, they have a brand, and they put it out for people to consume in that sense. It would be very nice for me to get something out of this experience, for me to get something out of making music, doing what I love on my spare time, rapping about things that I think are fun or funny. I don't want it to be something where I'm what I'm relying on. Like, I don't want it to be my main career, but if it's something I can do on the side and still have fun, then that's awesome. Thanks for having me.